Good morning guys, back with another video for you and remember last time I promised you guys so today hopefully we're gonna catch some fish and of course what's the best place you can be for good fishing? Sebastian Inlet. Yes sir, that's where we are as you can see in the background we're right by the inlet on the south side beautiful day right now is the outgoing tide it's gonna be a I have a good feeling man we're gonna catch some fish today so today obviously since we're in the inlet and I'm right by the bridge as you can see right here we're gonna free line our live bait I got my croaker right here as you can see nice size too I got small to medium size I got like 14 15 of them and also have that's my car right there gotta have your net if you're in the bridge gotta have that guys and then got our live shrimp as well there you go good size medium sizes so we're gonna be throwing that too our go-to rod and reel is gonna be the pan battle 2 5000 that's gonna do the trick we got a 30 pound braided line I got my number three circle hook and 50 pound leader you gotta have a good size leader here with this current and the structure underneath it's all rocks under there you definitely need something to hold so 50 pound leader will work perfect but without a further ado man let's get some fishing and live and I got my two split shots for weight right there right on top of the 50 pound leader and just free line it man outgoing tide is crazy the current is unreal so I put two more split shots right here above the hook and I got two right there between the braided line and the leader so they should keep me a little below the surface and that will be the nice area the target area so I'm gonna go ahead and lower it and let's see all right so here we go as soon as you lower it takes it anyways <laughs> it goes okay so there you go that's the under Perfect, it's exactly what we want. I also got one pinfish. They swim crazy, they didn't have enough. But these are the best bait for snook and redfish, man. They're so alive, they move so quick. And I hook them through the back, lower back, and let them swim. Very effective, but they only had croakers, so, hey. To my buddy on the Riggs Outpost hooked me up with the Krogers. So thank you Anthony. I appreciate it my brother. Hopefully with your bait I'll catch some good fish man. <laughs> Little update. Outgoing tide actually stop. Incoming tide about to come in so right now is perfect window to catch some redfish and snook guys. I'm throwing my gacha lure of course my go-to lure jigging it and hoping for some jacks redfish snook anything can bite because right now is the slack tide not moving in or out so we have a good two hours window before the crazy incoming tide and the current comes and that's a perfect window to catch good fish man 
Come on, gotcha allure. Got a catfish! <laughs> All right, wife got a catfish. Look at that beauty! Hey, I didn't catch it, guys. She did. <laughs> Good job, baby. That ship set, man. Woo -hoo -hoo. Wow! Come on, come on, get him! Hell yeah! Right by the bridge, guys, on the rocks. He got a nice ship's head. Come on in. Come on, net that ship's head, man. Ooh. Bring it in, bring it in. That is a huge ship's head. I've never seen one that big. <laughs> yeah, before. that's big, man. Wow, up. There he goes, Woo! in the net. <laughs> I just throw the croaker. <laughs> it's a fish on, baby. Oh, yes. What do we got? Is that Jack? That's a good head pull. Oh, come on, baby. Come to Bubba. Get the net, babe. Get the net ready. This one, big one. Don't worry about that. Leave it. No, no. The big net. You got to lower it down. Yep. Lower it down here. Or my, on my right. There you go. What do we got? Oh, what do we got? Yeah, there you go. Oh. Put it in the middle. Hold on. No, hold on. There you go. There you go. What do we got? Come on, baby. Oh, that was incredible. Screaming line. Lower, 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 Maya. Keep lowering, lowering. Maybe come this way. Yeah, go around me. Go, go, yeah. Go, 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 keep going. Oh. Oh. Jack, I think it's a jack. Nice big jack. Lower, lower, lower all the way. There you go. I know, I know. There you go. Yeah, it's a big jack. That was a good fight. Good Jack. Good yeah, yeah, I know. Good fight, man. Good fight. Woo. Oh, I got him on the live croaker. Oh, how about that? Yeah, thank you, man. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you, appreciate it. Yes, baby. <laughs> man, what a fight. Oh, yes. Look at that, baby. Woo. There you go, guys. Beautiful Jack. <laughs> yeah, baby. Nice. Uh, right on the side of the mouth with the circle hook. Oh, yeah. Look at those little teeth. Nice. There we go. Off the hook. Nice. Take a picture, babe. Yeah. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful Jack. Very nice. My phone's right there. Right there. Open that. Yep. That's it. Whoo! Yes, baby. Yes. Sebastian Inlet provides man on an incoming tide. I'll let you go, buddy. Don't you worry. Oh, perfect fight, man. Here we go. Head down. There he goes. Woo! Lives another day. Yes, baby. Yes. I love it, man. Oh, what a fight. What a fight. Yes.
just moved to the South Jetty. We left the bridge. It's crazy current since the incoming tides come in really bad. As you can see right here, the wind picked up. It's coming south, southeast. We're gonna try the inlet side. The incoming tide, the current is crazy, guys. Look at this. Look over there by the North Jetty. Ooh, it's ripping. Ripping all the way. Guys, I just left from the South Jetty into the beach area. Snook are feeling like crazy. <laughs> wow, dude, that's crazy. That is crazy. Oh, there we go. My god, I see a couple of snooks already jumping. If you can see the little minnows. The snook is destroying them right there. Oh, look, right there, right there, right there, right there, right there. Come on. Come on, Snooky. Come on, Snooky. Come on, Snooky. Oh, man. Dude. I know, I know. Oh my god, dude, that's crazy. This sucks, I'm out of live bait. Man. Man, this is crazy. Come on. Finally back home after two hours drive man. It's a long drive from Sebastian Inlet all the way to Orlando But it's well worth it. Let me tell you especially during summertime Sebastian Inlet is the only place you can really fish if you know what you're doing That is you know some areas. There's North Jetty. There's Lagoon under the bridge South Jetty rocks so there's a lot of areas you can fish, but you have to know when to fish, where to fish. So that's very important. It all depends on the current, the tide, how the water moves. So, you know, if you really study it, if you go there a couple times, you'll definitely get it as well. And that's what I want to do. I want to go back there this week, if not this week next week for sure again and try the things that I have observed and see and I think that's gonna work well for me I was originally planning on going to North Jetty but they actually closed the jetty early the north side um, we were there on 11 a.m. and they said it was capacity full so they were closed until 4 30 p.m. so be aware if you guys are going there every day they do the same thing so because lots of people they go with their family by the lagoon to swim and chill out there so there's a lot of people going to the north jetty versus the south jetty so it will fill up quick so if you want the north jetty you have to hit there early uh, take my advice for that so we ended up going to south that wasn't like I said my uh, ideal place to fish but that was the only place to go so we end up going to south I went to you know with my wife and by the way thank you my wife for coming with me she brought me good luck and finally I broke the curse man after three times you know going fishing and coming back with no fish well actually not catching anything 
And finally, I cut the big jack, which was an excellent, crazy fight, man. They fight really hard. So, thank you, my wife. I love you. You're my good luck charm. So, maybe I'll bring her next time as well. <laughs> and she cut the catfish, not me. So, that's another big bonus for me, too. <laughs> I gave her the torch for the catfish. But anyways... Uh, all in all, man, I had a blast. You know, it was a great day. I'm definitely gonna go back there, and I'm really glad that finally I got you guys a fish footage and this video. I'm very happy about that. But again, uh, I want to say thank you guys for watching and subscribing, or subscribing to my channel. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Make comment. Make a lot of comments, man. I love when you guys make comments. I love answering you guys, you know, that really motivates me, gets going. So I want to hit my next target, 1,000 subscribers, hopefully. And I want to do that. And the only way that I can do that is with your help. So again, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you on the next video. <laughs> see you guys.